This piece by Roland Brenner is one of my, it's always been one of my favorite works. Oddly enough, I can't remember the name of it. Isn't that stupid? It's called The Swinger. Oh, yeah. and guess why? <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. What's it made of? It looks like it's made of pudding. It's polyester resin. And he made three of them. Uh, one was kind of a steely gray, and it's in the Art Gallery of Windsor. And one was an aqua blue, and it's in a in a private collection. And this one was left and was in my living room for ages. <laughs> and then uh, Shelley and Tega did the summer show, and this was cheerful and the right color for them to include. So he's but he's very different here than in my living room because he has the space around him. Yeah. And he becomes more volumetric and you know, for a, and for a businessman with his tightly, uh, tightly buttoned suit around him, he's awfully grotesque. He's some kind of Humpty Dumpty. Uh, he has a strange grotesquery about him, especially as the physiognomy of his face. How, well, how do you Roland, square... Roland really didn't have great respect for serious businessmen. <laughs> so this was his way of toying with the image, you know, and made them into almost a bug kind of creature. Exactly. Uh, coming at you, both funny and slightly threatening, and, and but it also, in when the sunlight is coming from a certain direction, it's almost translucent. Uh -huh. It kind of glows from yeah. the interior, uh, which gives it another odd characteristic. I was just thinking how curious it is that it is both kind of anatomically sort of repulsive and the other time, and the other hand, at the same time, it succeeds in being sort of adorable. Isn't that I know, odd? I know. Well, it wasn't Roland like that. Yes, that's really. true. I mean, he was both totally obnoxious and <laughs> difficult and very funny and very brilliant. Yeah. And he just, you know, he surprised me with every show. He just... Uh, he would, I'd, I'd see work in a studio, and, and this would be the upcoming show, and then a month before the work was going to be shipped, he'd call me, oh, he says, I think you may be surprised. <laughs> I thought, oh, God, I wonder what's coming. And, and something like this would arrive. <laughs> totally unlooked for. But brilliant. Yeah. You know, brilliant yeah. every time. I love this guy. Thanks, Olga.